Hi everyone, welcome to DIY Ideas. Today I wanted to show you how you can do a headband or even a hairband if you like. So this is all out of just half trebles and you see the very pretty colors that we have today and they're meeting here in the knot part of the blue and the yellow. So this is a very simple but pretty knot we did um, and I'll show you how I did it in the ending of the video. So you can adjust the width and um, the size, meaning the length as well, of course, um, and the look itself. So it's depending on what you want to do and it's a very simple project that's also great for beginners. So if you guys want to see how you can do this as well, stay tuned. Okay, so here is my 4mm needle. The wool is fitting for the 4mm needle too. So this is Rico Design Light and Long, I think is the name. So it's very pretty and it's out of cotton this time. So I think we can start right away with some chains. Um, so yeah, let's get started and let's do three chains for now. And when you have those finished, go back into the first one and do a half treble. So again, we made three chains and then a half treble. After that, take two more for the height, two more chains, turn your work and again, close the stitch up. Second half treble and then let's go into the same spot and do another second half treble. So this is our first addition here, half treble and little chains here. Again two for the height, turn and again the same, half treble. And then I am again adding two half trebles into one spot. And the cool thing is that you notice the width right away. So in this round I have three half trebles and the chains of course that we always start with. So let's now repeat. Chains, first treble, second treble, and then the addition. Two for the height and turn. Close up and add into the last spot. So it keeps getting wider and now I'll do a bit more, I think until I reach this height and then when I stop with the additions I'll show you what I have. You see here the point of the hairband, so um, let's see, we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 rows and now row 10 is going to be the first one without additions. No additions here, two chains, turn and then go back. And this section I will keep working on as long as I need it, so this part you can of course vary too. 
depending of course on what you like better or um, what you have planned for. So feel free to do your own thing here, but um, I'm gonna say it's definitely better if it's a bit longer than a bit shorter. Here is my piece now and I have a nice length or diameter for my headband. Now all we need to do is finish by making the end point on the side. So I won't give any recommendations on the length since it really depends on what you like and what you want to do. So the project doesn't change if the length or the width changes, feel free to adjust. Two for the height and a half treble. And the last two half trebles we are doing together. All on the needle and just go through and that's how we get one stitch. Last two together again. Two for the height and we will just keep working it to the top. After a couple of minutes we have something like this. So let me finish this part. Here the chains and the one treble less and pull through and we are now done with our pointy part. So let's cut the thread off. We can then pull out the thread and weave it in as well as the beginning too. And now we are done, so let's do a knot. So I think the colors are pretty cool. Our knot is a bit different that way. Um, but yeah, depending on what wool you're working with or what you wanted to get, um, this can also be optional. So I hope you guys enjoyed the project. Let me know what you think in the comment section. Feel free to shoot a thumbs up as well. You can also subscribe to our channel and that way stay updated with everything new that we post. And also you can then gain access to our older videos and projects we already did. So thanks for watching DIY Ideas. I'll see you in our next project. Until then, have a great day. Bye!